Hi, I'm Joe Sinchoa, Chair of the Department of Otolaryngology here at University of California, Irvine. We really appreciate you choosing to spend a day with us, interviewing with us, and, and learning about our program. We definitely think we have something special here to offer residents. I think you'll find that our residents resoundingly agree, and we're excited to show you that. We know you have a lot of choices in your residency interviews, and again, we really appreciate you choosing to spend a day with us. While we would love to have you out here in Orange County and show you everything that Orange County has to offer for five years of training. We also recognize the value of virtual interviews and the last couple years have taught us a lot about virtual interviews and we've gotten good at them as I'm sure have the other 109 or so residency programs across the country. With that being the case I just wanted to say a couple things about residency here and why our residency training program is unique among the, the programs. Overall, when you're looking for a residency program, I think there's three things that are key that you want to get, and I think you probably have already thought about these things, but everyone wants to get good surgical and clinical training. That's definitely at the top of everyone's list. And I will say, if you are interviewing at an accredited residency program, which all 109 programs are accredited, you're going to get clinical and surgical training. So you don't have to worry about that. The clinical and surgical training you're going to get is going to be good across the board. Otherwise, the programs wouldn't be accredited. Secondly, what people want to do is learn what they want to do for the rest of their life. And so again, part of that is what you're going to do on a day-to-day -day basis, whether it's laryngology or head and neck surgery or neurotology or rhinology. And you'll get that at most of the programs. Here we have all seven subspecialties of ENT represented across our training program and so you'll be able to be exposed to all of those things and learn what it is you want to do for the rest of your career. But on top of that and something not a lot of applicants think about is where you want to do that. What practice setting do you want to be in? Do you want to be in private practice? Do you want to be at an academic institution? Do you want to be at a Kaiser? Do you want to be at a veterans hospital? All of those things are just as important as what you're going to be doing every day. And so here at UC Irvine, we're unique in that you will rotate through private practices. We have a lot of facial plastic surgeons in Orange County. We have a facial plastics fellowship here that's very well connected. And you'll get to see what a private practice setting is like. You'll get to work at the academic institution. We have a Kaiser that you get to work at. There's the Children's Hospital of Orange County, which is a foundation-based hospital. And there's the Veterans Hospital that you'll work at. And you'll get to see what doctors there think about on a day-to-day -day basis, what they like about their job, what they don't like about their job. And that's something that's very unique among training programs. The last thing that you want to get out of residency is mentorship and connections. Overall, across all of the training institutions here associated with UC Irvine, during your five years of training, you're going to work with over 35 fellowship trained otolaryngologists. And these are people who have been born and raised all across the country, and some even internationally, have trained in medical school, residency, and fellowship at all the different programs across the country. And so that network of over 35 physicians will get to know you very well during your training. We've done a good job of matching our fellows in the past, and I think that has to do with how collegial our department is and how we're a mid-sized training program with a lot of different practice settings that really prepare you well for not just the what you want to do, but the, the why you want to do it, the how you want to do it, and the where you want to do it. So welcome to our program. Please keep those things in mind. Again, I think we're a very uniquely situated training program, and really there's no better place to train than Orange County, California. So welcome, and I uh, hope you have a good day.